So one of the things I've been finding is as I go around and talk to agents and I connect with um, coaching clients, that everyone seems super occupied with sports. My kids are either at the ball field three days a week or they need to get to camp or they're doing something with a soccer thing. And everybody seems super challenged with their calendar and what's going on. So I kind of wanted to do a sports analogy today that might relate a little bit more to how do I gain a listing or a connection with a new client? So just remember these, these navigating of what we do in our everyday life definitely affects our ability for business. So um, as you navigate the sports field, I have a few things for you to think about. That is these activities of having to manage this. One, it takes time. It takes incredible patience to coordinate all of the things that your kids need. Um, of course, it re requires lots of love. You've also got to take time for that. It's a commitment that you're making to your children that you would like to be with them. You want to offer them the most incredible summer of their life. Um, it requires you to be a focused individual. That means not to forget anything, um, to do the laundry, to clean the gross shoes, whatever it might be, you're just totally involved in it. It requires planning. It definitely requires organization, or you might just never get everything else that you want to do for your busy business. It will require a high level of energy, and sometimes it's just sheer willpower to show up. When I talked to a parent the other day, they were like, I just don't know what I'm doing. I'm either in the car, I'm running, driving down the road, I can't, seeing a client, I'm doing all these wonderful things. So remember, this also takes practice just like your business. Sports isn't just a game. It's a useful tool for creating social and cultural content as far as being connected with others on the field. So remember, there's a business analogy to this part of what you're doing with your life. No matter what the sport is, players of all walks of life are tasked to work together to pursue a common goal. And so what I'm finding as a real estate agent, that for me would be the connection that I would want to make. There's a lot going on on the ball field that will benefit me and my business. Of course, the team wants to be victorious. Um, they want to win with the opposing team. So there's a little bit of action. There's a little bit of animation in it. Um, and players must set aside their differences to achieve those wins. Um, what we found is that the lessons that you learn in the game will over time give you what is the best team environment to win the game and it will change your life. And I think that's some of the, some of the notion of where's my business and where do I go for me is really a great correlation between you organizing your efforts to get to the ball field for your children, but also it builds conversation. Those people on the sidelines that you're standing with, those coaches that you talk to, those other parents that you connect with, those people can help build your business. It's a great, sports is a great conversation tool, a way to connect, a way to be the parent that brings the best snacks every time you go to the ball field. If I was a real estate agent with kids doing that, I would be the snack mama. I would bring all that connection, all those people. Oh, you're the greatest, right? Oh my God, when that mom shows up, we get these incredible snacks. That's connection right there with someone else that's gonna to wanna to sell or buy their home. So this is a great place for you in the summertime to not stop doing work, but continue to connect to build your business. Um, listen to, listening to those other people, asking them what they're doing, how are they managing that task? Are they super busy like you? Just being human with them and realizing that even if it's 104 in Grand Junction and you're standing outside doing soccer, right? You're sweating, you're feeling really crappy, you're still building connection for a future listing presentation or a future client that wants to buy and sell. So use this opportunity to make that really powerful, remind, remind yourself that here you are not only a connecting person, but you're also a role model and you're also believing in yourself by talking about who you are and what you do for your community. You are a community, community service advocate in some respects as a real estate agent. Give them their business card, tell them that you'll gladly connect with them. You are part of the fabric of the sports game while your children are out there doing their thing. You're also creating your networking and you're fabricating with the community. So really and honestly, stay connected, create these connections, and learn from the fact that this is time well spent also networking for your business. So have fun on the sports field and don't feel overwhelmed by the challenge ahead.